Good evening all you crazy motherfuckers on YouTube. I'm Lissa Shell, back with another video of whatever floats my boat. Or yours. But, sucky jokes aside, I just want to offer my, my take on the passing of Gary Coleman. I mean, he lived a hell of a lot longer than people expected him. Than most people expected him. Let me correct myself. And even with all the issues he had going on in his life, you couldn't deny that he was one ha that he had one hell of a personality. He was he was ambitious. Even I mean it's just, and it's just and a few a few decades later it's just wrong I still think that it was just beyond wrong for for what his parents did to him I mean if I was treated like a meal ticket from if I was treated like a meal ticket at a young age and had everything had damn near every last penny drained out of my account right when I got emancipated from my parents, I'd have a fucked up life too. But, you know, I'm not trying to talk ill of Gary here. And I'm not going to throw in a what you talking about Willis in anywhere in this. Because it's like, that's what I don't get. The moment Gary, the moment people hear that Gary Coleman's died, People want to throw in a what you talking about Willis in their videos like like that's supposed to be some type of tribute or whatever. Same thing with the same thing with Michael Jackson passing. When he died, everybody thinks they can everybody thinks they can be a participant in last comic standing or something. Or they want to throw in a pedophile joke. Yeah, like those haven't been used before. Get the fuck out of here with that shit. But anyway, my prayers do go out to his loved ones, and I pray that they get the closure that they need, because, and I hope that Gary's found the peace and death that he couldn't find in life. I'm Melissa Shell, and I'll see you in hell.